US COAST GUARD PULLS OFF AN AMAZING RESCUE ON THE ICE OF LAKE ST. CLAIR AND THE VIDEO SHOWS HOW THEY DISCOVERED A MAN WALKING ACROSS THE FROZEN LAKE. SIMON SHAKETTE WAS THERE BEFORE HE HEADED TO THE HOSPITAL FOR THIS BREAKING STORY. HERE IT IS. THERE HAS NOT BEEN AN ICE RESCUE LIKE THIS IN FOUR YEARS. THE U.S. COAST GUARD ACTING VERY QUICKLY TO SAVE THE LIFE OF A MAN WHO WAS HEADED TO CANADA. On the ice of Lake St. Clair, the U.S. Coast Guard out on patrol. Suddenly, they see something no one could have expected. We came across the individual who was trying to uh, walk across the ice um, from Detroit um, to Canada. Toronto, to be exact. At 10 a.m., this guy looking lost and cold as can be. Without proper clothing or boots, he's on the verge of hypothermia. Slurring his words, um, unable to respond to... Normal interactions and he had lost all feeling in his feet. An ice rescue team from the Coast Guard cutter Nia Bay is ready, trekking out onto the ice to get this 25 year old man to safety. They make contact and the man reveals he's homeless and can't explain why he started walking across the lake. He was 16 miles from Detroit and that's where he, had, he said that he had started walking. Quickly, they help the man across the ice and over to the cutter. They hand him a flotation device and assist him on board. Eventually, they make it back to the shores of Algonac. The ambulance met us on the pier, um, continued to administer first aid to the individual, and then escorted him to the, or transported him to the local hospital. The Coast Guard says, thankfully, the man's attempt to illegally cross into Canada ended without tragedy. But no question, the rescue came not a moment too soon. That man who was rescued is still in the hospital receiving treatment. He is also receiving a psychological evaluation. From downtown Detroit, Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News.